Thermal Ride has made it incredibly difficult for any other manufacturer to compete in the air cooling department. They offer fantastic performance at a reasonable price, and their coolers often outperform pricier options. The same is true for the Peerless Assassin 140, an air cooler with an unorthodox fan design, plenty of performance, and a low price tag. This cooler is a slightly improved version of the highly successful Assassin 120. It features a larger heatsink, a denser fin array, and a combination of a 120mm and a 140mm fan. The new cooler is also much bigger, which we'll get to later. The design is quite similar to that of other air coolers from Thermalright. You get a dual tower structure, six 6mm copper heat pipes that are anodized black, and a larger cold plate at the bottom to cover the CPU effectively. If you're building an all-white PC, you could also grab this cooler in a white finish. The heatsink has an asymmetrical design, meaning RAM clearance is not an issue. If you have taller dims, you can raise the front fan by a few millimeters to make everything fit. Speaking of which, making this cooler fit inside your case might be an issue if your chassis is on the smaller side. This applies to just about any beefy dual tower cooler, including the Peerless Assassin 140. If you have a micro ATX case, check the dimensions before you buy it. For most mini ITX cases, this cooler will have an even tougher time fitting in. For the fans, this cooler uses a hybrid fan setup. You get a 120mm TLC12B V2 at the front, and a 140mm TLD14CB in between the two towers. Both fans have a maximum speed of up to 1500, and the 140mm fan has higher airflow. While the sheer size of the cooler is something to worry about, it puts that large footprint to good use. During heavy gaming workloads, the Peerless Assassin 140 handles CPUs like the i7-12700KF impressively well. Temperatures hover around 75 to 78 degrees, which is not bad at all for a power-hungry CPU like the 12700KF. That level of performance is on par with a lot of entry-level and mid-range 240 radiator AIOs, which is highly impressive at this price point. Noise levels aren't all that bad either. At full load, both fans will ramp up to 100% speeds, and the noise levels rise to 42 to 43 decibels. While that's not necessarily what I'd call quiet, it's on par with other dual-tower air coolers when paired with modern Intel CPUs. Although it's worth mentioning that Be Quiet's Dark Rock Elite is a bit quieter. On that note, the Dark Rock Elite is the main competitor here. The performance of the two is very similar, though the Dark Rock Elite is slightly quieter and comes with RGB. Here's the kicker though, the Peerless Assassin 140 is half the price of the Dark Rock Elite and provides the same level of performance. It's a no-brainer to pick the PA140 for budget builds. As far as thermal ride coolers go, the verdict here is very familiar. The Peerless Assassin 140 is a high-performance CPU cooler with a very affordable price. The performance is impressive, and the only reason you'd want to skip this is because of the sheer size. Other than that, I can't find any real problems with this cooler. To sum up, what I like is the aggressive performance, the easy installation process, the moderate noise levels, and the low price. On the downside, it's quite big and it won't fit into many MATX and mini ITX cases. Thanks for staying till the end. Remember, you can check current prices in the description below. And if you're looking to optimize your PC even further, don't stop here. We have more videos filled with suggestions and reviews to help you make the best decisions.